I learned something from Valerio Lipovetsky today that resonated with me so much that I really want to share it with you in today's episode. She said that she realized that you really need to learn how to capitalize on those days and moments in your life where you feel really productive. And then so that you can let yourself rest and have that space to not create in the moments that you don't feel productive. And if, or productive and creative. And I think it's very interesting because as someone who does produce a lot of content online, you do realize that on some days you just feel on top of the world. It feels like you have so many ideas, you have so much energy to create that you feel like every day will be like that. And uh, you can just like create a bit and don't really capitalize on that moment because you feel like that the moment like that will always be there. And then other days you just feel nothing you don't feel like creating anything and you don't feel that new ideas are coming in and everything feels a bit rigid and you always feel like oh no now all of the days will look like that so firstly none of the days will look exactly the same you'll have both and secondly here what i'm trying to say i'm not ever saying I'm actually a big advocate for showing up when you don't feel like showing up and for doing the work even when you're tired and even when you don't feel like doing that work. I'm still an advocate for that. But I'm saying, can't we just work can we can't we just make working a lot and producing a lot more fun and easier for us? And the answer is yes, because of course when we are in that state and we learn how to capitalize on that moment when we feel really creative and productive and we can produce so much more that we can create that and then allow for the space when we don't feel as productive to use the content that we already pre-created or to to use the work that we have already pre-done before. Do, I, do you see what I mean? And I feel like that's a skill that we can do because the moment you realize that you are in a state of flow, you can make it become consciously aware of that and then say okay what can I do today what kind of outputs can I produce and how much of that do I want to do and just go with it and push yourself to actually create when you feel like creative and also thinking about your future self that will thank you because at one point of in time which will come again you will not feel in that zone and it will be very hard for you to produce but you your past self would have already helped your future self I hope this episode gives you clarity on how to deal with life because it really helped me. I was really struggling some days where I did not, I felt the pressure from myself mostly to show up and produce and stuff like that. And it, it almost felt like very rigid because I was, it, it, sometimes I was not in that state. And today, for example, I was in an amazing state. It was so easy for me to produce content. And then I remembered this quote from this realization from Valeria and it all clicked in one place. I realized that, hey, today is the day when I feel in the flow, in the zone, and I just need to capitalize on that moment. And then in other moments, it will be okay because I would have already created other things that I can post. I hope that also is as a cool <laughs> realization for you as it was for me. And um, I hope it does give you also a bit of peace of mind. And thank you so much for watching this episode and I see you in the next one tomorrow.